Derby. Um, let's speak to Hassan in Slough. What's your view on this, Hassan? Hi, hello, Governor. Hi there. Um, yeah, so three three points to make, actually. Uh, firstly, I, I don't believe in cancel culture. Um, I think uh, those who want to cancel someone else out for their opinions, uh, uh, it's, it's a very lazy way of doing it. I mean, my approach is um, trying to engage with those who disagree with me so, uh, and in order to influence, so that takes some work. So I'm a, I'm a, a British Bangladeshi Muslim myself, mm. and um, I've been trying to engage with those on the far right. Uh, so, you know, they're, they're quite so fair when it comes to the, the Islamophobic comments. And I'll be coming out with my third book later in the year, which actually deals with arguments um, raised by the far right, especially the Islamophobic ones. And I did engage in dialogue as well with, with one of the uh, far right uh, sympathisers. And, uh, and that's where wow. we can influence each other rather than trying to shut, shut down uh, debate. The second point is, um, you recall about, about two months ago when the race report, uh, the commission report came out, um, led by Dr. T- uh, Tony Sewell. Yes. And there was a lot of controversy around it. And that, I mean, the debate should have happened, a constructive debate, it didn't, it was cancelled out. Uh, some of the critics said, oh, let's burn the report, uh, uh, et cetera. I'm trying to uncancel that debate because I'm coming up with my second book, which is imminent. I'll send you a free copy. You're a very prolific <laughs> author. <laughs> a budding author, yes. yes. Uh, someone late bloomers like myself. Why not? Um, and I deal with the uh, uh, the criticisms uh, that the critics of the report raised in great, great detail. So that's going to come out soon. And we need a constructive debate. Uh, my, my third point is that you'll you recall uh, when Katie Hopkins was a presenter at LBC a few years ago. Yes. And I did engage in a dialogue with her just after the Westminster Bridge attacks in 2017, right. explaining about Muslims and the concerns British people might have about Islam and Muslims. For those seven minutes, we had a great conversation. Uh, and for that short moment in time, she did actually have, have positive views about Muslims. But a few months after that, she was cancelled out of LBC. And what do you do? And what, what happens when people are cancelled out? They go bonkers. And unfortunately, Katie has gone bonkers. So we need to engage in a debate where we can both learn from each other. No, that's a very good point, Hassan. Look, good luck with the third book. Um, more prolific than uh, Beatrix Potter. Very, very good. Um, Thank you very much. You've been listening to...